Hey guys, happy first day of the semester! Woo! Went grocery shopping because, yeah, it was time. And I even called my mom and everything. I'm like, mom, like, how do I improve my my Latina side? Because I just don't really cook. Like, to my Colombian friends, if you were to see the meals I make, it would be like, where is the Colombian meals at? Um, there's too much stuff and I don't want to do a grocery haul, okay? I'm sorry. But I will say my favorite purchase um, were these two things. Uh, if you remember, I don't know how long ago the video was, but I told you guys how I mix my milks with almond milk and soy milk, I think. Is that what I said? I don't even remember, it's been that long ago, but I usually do mix my milks because I love the co Oh no, it was all, yes, it was almond and soy, right? Or almond and O? So, we're going, almond and something I would always mix my milks with. And I saw that at Walmart, Silk has a mixed wine with almond and cashew. Oh wait, I actually want to try it. And it has 10 grams of protein. Are you kidding me? Everything in my apartment is blue. My bedroom is blue. My pants, my pots and pans are blue. Everything's blue. Um, it's perfect for an egg. I love breakfast sandwiches. So I usually like try to make it circular on the big pan. But I actually saw someone buy this, and I said, "Yeah, I want this a lot." And look how cute. Are you kidding? Let's get unpacking. Oh, uh, what I lit, what I'm currently listening to. Zane and Heath, Unfiltered, the newest episode, uh, 194. I look, Zane and Heath, Unfiltered. Every, every time they mention their Patreon, I'm like, yeah, I'm going to buy it. I'm going to buy it. And I just never do. But I, this semester, I had to cave in because I genuinely really, really like them. I was so sad. I need to unpack my stuff. Anyway, when they came to UCF because they were promoting their happy hour drinks, um, I'm underage, I wasn't able to attend, and I'm so upset, I'm so mad, but that's okay, because I will meet them one day. I, when, where, how, who knows, but I will. to mention I am starting to realize that hey drinking only water should not be like a I, I don't know like when I stop drinking everything but but I guess juice once in a while and I was only drinking water I literally like used it as a, as a personality trait up to like my freshman year of college and I was like okay what is it like just drink stuff but water like it's not that serious and if i have a good bladder and good kidneys i should be fine drinking everything in the world so i started drinking poppy because it helps with yeah you guessed it pooping so the flavors that i have tried are strawberry lemonade orange and cherry limeade i liked every single one of them and now I'm going to be trying watermelon and ginger lime. Woo -woo. <laughs> Not sponsored yet. Not sponsored yet. Not sponsored yet. Come on, guys. Let's, let's manifest this. And I'm starting to realize I'm running out of space. So. Okay, so I just put everything away. Now I'm just going to be washing and prepping my fruit. Um, the ones that go in the fridge, of course. And I 
usually buy chopped spinach that's already frozen because it's just easier but unfortunately at Aldi it was sold out so I just bought uh, fresh spinach and I'm gonna be cutting it up and then freezing it because I put spinach in everything and anything on my smoothies and in every single one of my meals because it it's good for you <laughs> I don't know I just really 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 love spinach so yeah that's what I'm gonna be doing and by having it pre-chopped, it's just easier when cooking so that I don't have to take it out, chop it up. It's just, it's another step. Um, actually, let me rephrase that. It's a one less step to worry about. And I don't think I'm going to do that with the mushrooms just because some days I like having, I like cutting them certain ways depending on the meal. But yeah, that's basically it. I don't know. Next clip. Could tell this hasn't been used since last semester. And there's a whole bug on it. Anyway. First day of junior year, guys. Let's go do this thing. I'm running late. What am I doing? I'm literally... <laughs> okay, I don't know what in the world is wrong with this color grading that the iPhone's giving me, but it's looking very much ugly. <laughs> but I just left my class and my dreams are coming true with them being super hands-on as a media production major that was my literal goal was to get as much experience as possible because getting it in the real world is very a competitive or b difficult to find especially in orlando it's that i'm not in a big city like atlanta new york or la that that's like the hub of jobs Okay, hello guys. So I just got back from my second class and I'm gonna have not a girl lunch. That's exactly what I have. Not a girl dinner, a girl lunch. And I'm gonna be trying the Natalie's pineapple and kale zinc. Orange juice. But yeah, first let's try this. I'm really excited. Pineapple, kale and zinc. Hope it's good. Don't smell your food, guys. It's rude. Mmm. 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 So that will be going in my smoothies. It's just, okay, here's the thing. 
It has a very, 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 very strong celery taste, okay? Remove the celery and I think it will actually be very delicious for my snacky snack. I just got back from class and yeah, that's it. It was, you know, the first week of class, just a bunch of introductions and going over the syllabus and like getting into the course, but very, very surface level. Yeah, I have my second class this evening at 6 p.m. to 8.50. <laughs> I can't wait. I'm so excited. Yeah, this semester is going to be so much fun. Like, genuinely speaking, from heart to heart, I was going to do this. Like, what does this have to do with being heart to Honestly, Attack on Titan... It has nothing to do with this, so I don't know why I thought I was going to do that. But side tangent, side tangent with the tech on tight end. What's up with the franchise? Is it just my TikTok for you page? I hope my phone hears it. I've gotten no fan edits, no uh, commentary on the episodes that released for, what What was it, part three? Am I, be am I behind? Wait. Part three, that's what it is. Not part four. There's a part four? Okay, so yeah. I need to get on to that. Okay. I I finished the book, so it's the, the excuse me, the mangas. I finished the manga, so I don't like I don't have that urge to see what's gonna happen, but oh the music and the animation. But the Part four, season four, part four, the little finale of the season, of the whole series. Uh, so it's supposed to come out this fall. Oh my God, I'm so excited. You know what today is? Did I buy this magazine on Amazon? Yeah, not Amazon, excuse me, on eBay. Yeah, you know why? Okay, sit down, have a chat, grab some water. Let me quickly tangent about this specific magazine. I was going to pre-order it, but in my head, I was like, mm, let me just wait. Most likely it's going to be, I have three Barnes and Nobles. This magazine is, is going to be available at some point, somewhere at one of these locations, Target, Walmart, whatever, wherever they sell magazines. Funny enough, I couldn't find this magazine anywhere. When I say any, like sold out or not, I could not find it anywhere. And I told myself, okay, at the time this magazine released, I would be in London. So I checked all the airports, um, not all the air, I checked the airport uh, stores for the magazines, nowhere to be found. Uh, I had two separate layovers. I checked throughout the city, walked in bookstores, um, any magazine stand, anything, I looked for that magazine, nowhere to be found. But this magazine company, Empire, is located in London, in the UK. So I assumed they would have a bunch of these wrong, 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 wrong. I was so wrong. So I just told myself, whatever, I'll just buy it on eBay. And I did buy it on eBay for a reasonable price. And it came in the most perfect condition ever. Oh my, look at that. I even opened up to it. Like, oh. always two there are, you guys. Look at, also, I just showed you guys clips of art uh, that I came across while walking on campus. And I wanted to promote them if you guys are curious on purchasing any art. It was beautiful. It was super cool. I... Wanted to ask, and I did. I did ask one of the students if I could record, and I overheard one of them asking, like, oh, like, why am I filming? And I clearly need to gain more confidence in my YouTube because the fact that I was embarrassed of trying to show them my YouTube, yeah. I just, they asked me, like, oh, like, what, what's it for? What's it for? Which, 
100% is a valid question because when it comes to art, especially at the student level, like you don't want your art to get stolen. So I, w I just came forward. I was like, I have a YouTube channel and I like showing clips of my life. And I was showing them and yeah, I wanted to promote them because it was such, such cool artwork. And I wanted the whole world to know about the cool artwork. Gave some promotion as well as I will link them in the description below to their social media accounts. If you guys are interested in purchasing any of the artwork, please, please support uh, students. Mm -hmm.